Answer 2021 MBA question paper out of video solution. We are looking at a data sufficiency question. Interesting question, conceptually simple, but it's a word problem set as a data sufficiency question. Two types of widgets, namely type A and type B, are produced on a machine. The number of machine hours available per week is 80. So, available machine hours is 80. How many widgets of type A must be produced is what the question is. Statements are from Pakla. Answer option is A if statement 1 alone is sufficient. It is B when statement 2 alone is sufficient. It is C when 1 and 2 together are sufficient. If the data is insufficient, then we will go with D. What is the question? How many types, how many widgets of type A must be produced? 40 widgets of type A must be produced. 22 widgets of type A should be produced. So, in the Kelvik answer one is going to be a number. We know if the answer to the question is a number, the data is sufficient when we have a unique value. With this equipped with this knowledge, let us take a look at statement 1. One line is clear. One unit of type A widget requires two machine hours and one unit of type B widget requires four machine hours. Wonderful. Mottama nama kaila rikkarudhu, enbadu machine hour rikku. So, we will look at again counter example e edutthikla, right? Type A yethana pannap pooro, type B yethana pannap pooro. Idhila vandhu uru unique or ever answer varudha avdiin pakkala. Total time available is equal to 80. So, we can go with type A pannarudhu kevala nera hao is going to take us 2 hours per type A and 4 hours per type B. Available machine hours is equal to 80. 80 you use pannit oma na vangu solala. 80 yoda kamiya goda use pannala. But we M bad me use pannit oma na vangu solala. For example, I can go in example 1, 30 of type A which will require number yudave hours taken will be 60. And then idhik number vandhu 5 of type B hours taken will be equal to 20. So, total machine hours available is equal to 60 plus 20, 80 equal to mudishtu. Ippa yethana type A nama produce pannit irukkoum? 30 produce pannit irukkoum. Is this the only answer option that is possible? Definitely not. We will just go with something else. We will take 10 of type A, avdina we will require 20 machine hours. And then we will go with 15 of type B. In that case, we will require 15 into 4, 60 machine hours. Together, that also works out to 80. Ithi 80 hours irukkoum na ausim ilanam. Maximum 80 hours irukkoum. 40 hours na use pannit irukkoum okay. So, do we get a unique answer with this? We know it takes 2 hours and 4 hours. And that is all we know. Yevlo produce pannu nong, idhir yadha minimum pannu nama, adhir yadha maximum pannu nama, yenda vitha data mila. For example, we could have produced 40 of type A and 0 of type B. We could have produced 0 of type A and we could have gone for 20 of type B. All of these are possible combinations. So, unique ka ura answer kadakke la. So, statement 1 alone is not sufficient. One sufficient lena, we know we can eliminate answer option A. One of the other three will be our answers. Let us take a look at statement 2 alone. Let us see what we get from it. The widget dealer wants to supply, wants supply of at least 10 units of A. So, number of units of A is A in At least 10 is na minimum 10. 10 is less than 10. So, 10 is okay, but 10 is less than 10. So, the number of units of widget A, we will call it as A, that should be greater than or equal to 10. 10 is okay, 10 is less than 10. And he would not accept less than 15 units of type B. 15 is Minimum again 15 B is equal to So, B should be greater than or equal to 15. We do not know how many hours are required for A, how many hours are required for B. For example, if you say they want a minimum of 10, we can say, we can take 10 and take 10. Or it could have been take 14 or take 115. We do not know how many machine hours are required to manufacture each of these widgets. All that we know is minimum value for A is at 10. It could be 11, it could be 15, it could be 200, it could be 2000. Infinite possibilities exist with this. So, statement 2 alone is also not sufficient. This is rule out. Combine money Let us see whether it makes sense. When you combine the two statements, we know A requires, right? This is number of hours, number of units for A, number of hours for B, num number of hours, number of hours for B, and then number of units of B. Right. So, number of hours required for A is equal to 2, minimum greater than or equal to 10 of the number of hours required for B is 4, greater than or equal to 15 of the total available machine hours is equal to 80. In the least, you can see 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 the least, 
So, 2 hours required for each unit of widget A and a minimum of 10 will have to be produced. So, now 2 into 10, 10 produce pound on 20 hours. This is the minimum of 15 from statement 2. 4 hours for each widget B. So, 4 into 50 that will make it as 60. So, on the minimum quantity A and B produce pound on the machine hours 20 plus 60, 80. That is the maximum oil machine hours. So, we cannot produce anything more than 10 of A and anything more than 15 of B to ensure that the minimum requirement is taken care of and we do not use up more than the available machine hours. So, if you do one case, you will satisfy the minimum 10 A, minimum 15 B, 2 hours per uh, unit of uh, 2 hours the time required for 1 unit of widget A and 4 hours for 1 unit of widget B and total available time of ET, all conditions satisfy the one case which is when A is equal to 10 and B is equal to 15. Do we have a unique answer by combining the statements? Yes. So, the statements together are sufficient. Data insufficient and possibility illa. Choice C is the correct answer to this question.